Hey, this is Week Two One Hundred One. I'm recording on the other camera again. Um, so, but this is in back at home. It's more like normal kind of daylight. Um, but saying that, <laughs> I'm saying that it's kind of like the evenings. So it's not perfect lighting, so bear with me. I'm working on it on this one. But this is my glossy box for October going in the usual packaging i'm sure everyone's heard of glossy box by now about the system but just in case 12.95 monthly subscription um so five items uh, but this month it's six the six pack so a great big card compared to the usual um so it's all about it's their sixth box um so they've given a sixth tree we kind of call a bit of this like every time so by the tenth box turn somehow i don't think that's going to happen but it's kind of cool for them to have done that this time. Um, blah, blah, blah. Great. Okay. First thing that's different is you've got a scannable code um, on the sheet there. So I'm guessing that takes you direct to the um, Glossy Box website so you can use it sort of out and about on your phone, what have you. And then we've got three dermatological products, which is awesome. Um, one Nathan Denny Steeler and oh gosh, how do you pronounce that? Robert Piguet? Piguet? Something like that. <laughs> it's definitely French, so I've just butchered it. I apologise. It looks really pretty. Tied up in a bow. I redid it. <laughs> I'm sad like that. Um, and then inside, the first thing I noticed is this month is a full box. You can see. Oops. Now, bear with me again, I'm going to have issues getting it right in the camera, so I'll try and um, learn the focusing. So we've got the perfumes. Okay, perfume samples aren't everyone's cup of tea on these boxes because you either like them or you don't like them. And also, in these sizes, you're not like loads to try. However, this is a brand I've not heard of before, and so consequently, it's really nice to get the samples because it's not something... I would have thought to have asked for, so I had going to Boots and got it myself. And also, for example, I don't even know if these are available, say, in Boots. They may be, um, what does it say, three signature scents from the most Parisian of fashion designers. So that's pretty awful that I've never heard of them as a fashion brand, but they should be, they do smell quite nice, quite strong scents. I can smell it, say, through the cardboard. But they came in this little pretty little bag, which would be really useful. Um, sort of like hair grips or hair bands, like when you're away, as I'm travelling a lot at the moment. That would be awesome. And this one, oh, this is my favourite one. This is Baby Doll, the Leighton Denny Nail Varnish. And this is, this is coming up a little bit paler to real life. So it's a really nice, which is if I bring it back, if it's more true. No, for some reason it's got really pale. So yeah, oh, it's pale, not just pale. <laughs> um, it's like a really lovely, what I call, I suppose, baby pink. Um, it's like got a nice kind of, kind of colour. It's basically small, it's more vibrant than that, than the kind of looking bit white. It's more, more pink to it. But love that. And that's a full size 12 millimetre. And do they have the prices on here? Oh, they do have the prices. Okay. This is full size and it's 12, ugh, 11 pounds full price. So that is pretty good. So basically you've got your money back just on that. And that's something I'll definitely use. Then the other one is Stila Smudge Stick Waterproof Eyeliner in, I don't know if Marais is that the colour? Does it say on here? Oh yeah, Marais is the colour. Stills highly pigmented waterproof eyeliner glides on delivering intense vibrant colour with staying power. Ah, and this one it's not actually like a pencil. I don't know if that the <laughs> plum moment. It's kind of like almost like a crayon, but this is exactly like my Clinique ones. You don't have to sharpen it, which is brilliant. I hate sharpening it, it gets everywhere, you get a bit stuck in there, and ugh. So um that's brilliant. It's waterproof, really like that, and it looks I think it's going to be sort of a greeny. Oh, it's grey. Is that grey? It's hard to tell you this light. I think it's grey. It's like sparkly, but it went on really easily. And yeah, it's got like, it's really sort of silver sparkly. 
tired. Oh, my light's gone out. It's very cold, otherwise. Woo! Um, I'm really rubbing at that. And that is still, still there. So if you can see that, it's still on my hand. And I've just been rubbing right at that. So it definitely has got staying power. Maybe not intense staying power, as in the whole colour won't stay. But you've definitely got a bit left over there. God, I hope that comes off. <laughs> um, so that's that one. I'll just put that back in the box. Now, lastly, oh, well, I suppose four, including this, is the Dermalogica. That's like a little um, sort of sponge bag. I'm thinking, is that long enough for an eyeliner? Yeah, that is. So that'd be quite a nice little makeup bag. Um, or maybe, I'm thinking, maybe in my handbag, I might use that um, for like a few little makeup bits. So that'd be really nice. And oh, yeah, it came with this little lip. Um, Product as well. Shit, time we on. Um, 0.3 fluid ounces renewal lip complex age mark. Now that is tiny weeny, but when I had a facial, um, I used to have dermatological facials until my skin got really bad. Um, not a result of the facials, it just I was told I couldn't have them anymore because of the um, sort of like the exfoliation would really irritate it and make it worse. Um, and after facial, they either like do your eyebrows or add like a lip balm and I think this must be this one and from what I remember it was really really good so really happy that and again I used to be in this day <laughs> um so yeah that'd be again a nice little handbag size really good and I'll put that in the little, little, little tissue <laughs> then we've got now these three are all age smart including the lip balm and I know for some people they really weren't happy about um age products However, I said somebody on Twitter today, uh, it's Holly, I can't remember her full Twitter name, um, the same name, once we were 30, we would be so clued up about age products, it's been brilliant. And that day, we will remember these days <laughs> and be thankful that we kind of know what's going on at that time. So for that reason, I, don't, I personally don't mind getting age-rated products. Also, as I'm 25, nearly 26, starting to get the old forehead wrinkles, so I'm starting to think about age products. Um, so really interested to try these. And then what I was trying to say, which turned out to be a rather long-winded way, is these do a lot more than just the age properties. So I take them one at a time. We've got the multivitamin power recovery mask. These are both 0.5 fluid ounces. So if you saw my um, last video, the Feel Unique Beauty Box, I think the samples were a little bit bigger. The cleanser, I think, was, I want to say 18 mil. Oh, that's 15 mil. Oh, it's not that much difference. <laughs> um, ignore that then. <laughs> uh, so what have we got? Powerful mask with concentrated vitamins to help the skin recover from damage that leaves the skin aging when enhancing various properties promoting healthy tissue regeneration. The multivitamin power mask. But it's all about multivitamins for like energy looks in skin, in the skin sort of revitalised, blah, blah, blah. Um, and that one, so yeah, it just says antioxidant vitamins. I'm all about that. Brilliant. All about the skin regeneration. Even my terrible skin at the moment. Um, and this one is uh, the multivitamin thermofoliant. Powerful skin polisher with unique thermal technology that activates upon contact to enhance penetration of age fighting ingredients into the skin. So I took this to be that if I use that in combination with the other one with the multivitamin, it would just help the multivitamins get in. And that's going to give my skin like energy. It's going to just do marvellous stuff, <laughs> if I believe the packaging. Um, but uh, yeah, it's not just about age, in my opinion. A good cleanser, a good moisturiser, good products. Um, they'll do a lot more. That's the whole point, I suppose, the new age stuff, is that um, I personally be looking for something that is a mattifying skin, to have quite oily skin and age related so I think the whole kind of age thing is just almost like an on top that's turned out to be a really long winded which was meant to be short winded but that's everything in this like glossy box um i sorry it's taken me so long like I had to rush back home from up north for a work reason and uh, rush back so I quickly opened it but that's a touch of video before I had to rush back long story but yeah, so I'm glad I got that done finally. I'll also do some pictures on my blog so you can see um, the products a bit more closely or if you've forgotten the name of one of them, I'll put them in the drop box below. Um, and if anyone's looking to sign up to Glossy Box, I would 
thoroughly recommend it. I know this month doesn't seem, although it's got six products in it, it doesn't seem very sort of exciting. A lot of people have said it's quite a new kind of box. Um, gosh, we're too old to be going new. <laughs> but anyway, um, but I've been a really big fan so far and with the combination of the ones before and this one, this one has a hair product in. I'm liking the hair products. I hope there'll be a good hair product in the next one. They're saying that I'm still using the ones from the previous book, the Make It Grill, still loving that. Um, yeah, I would thoroughly recommend it. It's a nice treat, especially coming up to Christmas, where I'm having to spend a lot of money and everyone else buy Christmas presents. I will get like a little treat in the place for me, so that'd be quite nice. Also, I'm thinking of what we're going to do for Christmas. <laughs> um, so that's my video for now. Um, so let me know what you think about the new. Um, camera so i apologize the color isn't great today so i'll make sure i film videos like earlier in the day um to get them looking a bit better just tidy up so <laughs> all right but thanks for watching thanks for all my new subscribers hello to all my old subscribers and um thank you very much it's been awesome like i never thought i'd get as many subscribers as i have so thank you <laughs> bye for now see you in my next video